It has been said that faith is not merely you holding on to God. It is God holding on to you. In the Bible, in 1 Peter 5, verse 6 and 7, the Bible says, Humble yourselves under the mighty hand of God. Now, humble means to be teachable. It means not to be just so staid in your ways that you won't change, you won't listen. Sometimes, especially as we mature and think that we've been there and done that and seen it all, well, sometimes that's harder to do. Yet, we must open up to God's wisdom, God's ways, and God's actions through us. Now, question, do the demands of this day tend to overwhelm you? Have you ever been overwhelmed? Well, I have, and I get overwhelmed even today. There are some times that this happens because I'm human, you're human. And sometimes the demands on us seem so incredibly great. Especially when I'm traveling, especially when I'm going out of the country, I have to do everything in advance, and sometimes that tends to overwhelm. And whenever I get overwhelmed, I know that that's a signal to my human self that I need to go to God. That no matter how much I have to do, I need to go apart for a while. And that is completely opposite from what the human being wants to do. The human being wants to get in there and go faster and push more. Take heart, though, if you ever feel this way. You rely not on your own resources or your family or your friends' resources, but on God's resources. And this is something that is learned daily. I don't know that you can learn this once and keep it with you because daily demands change, increase and decrease, and sometimes they sneak up on us. Well, God is your never-ending support of courage, and God will be with you every moment when you remember to step back and to call upon God. So my friend, when you're weary, when you just don't know how you're going to do everything that you have to do, God will give you strength. But you have to go to God and be literally bathed in that strength. When you see no hope, this is a time to go to God because God will remind you of God's promises, even when you can't see it with your human eyes. And when you grieve, God's power will overcome, will comfort, even when you think there is no way. God will hold your hand and walk with you every day of your life if you let God. But that requires humbling the human, becoming teachable again. So even when my circumstances are difficult or your circumstances are difficult, we need to trust God. God's love is absolutely eternal. It is never turned off, and God's goodness endures forever.